So this tree is the Hermie tree. Mm -hmm. oh, two of them. Oh, okay, so they branch out from the bottom? Yeah, so so the original single trunk died in the freeze, and anytime it, all of them died in the freeze, and all I did was leave it alone, and then the single trunk kind of fell away, and it sprouted two new trunks. Wow. And then that one back there is a male. Same thing, the original trunk died, so it, uh, I left the original trunk, and then eventually it fell away, and then four new trunks. Okay. Just are the there. flowers fragrant? Yes, like if you get close, you can smell it. When the in the morning when I come out, they're the most fragrant, and the whole yard smells like it. They're probably gonna stop blooming right now because normally the clusters are really oh cool, gosh. but you can see they're starting to die off. Yep. And he's just male, never never produced any fruit. It's gorgeous looking though. Here. It's a beauty for a landscape. Oh my gosh. And uh, I haven't tried one yet. The lady who gave them to me, she said the fruits are really, really sweet. Even the Hermie one. Do papayas usually have their fruit hang out like this? The, I know only the Hermie or the Hermie ones. Okay. So the Hermies, they they grow from the same cluster where the flower is. They'll have one female in the cluster. Okay. So like even up there, you see I've got one, yep. one little one growing. Yep. But okay. here's the female, and this is how all the females normally have the fruit just on the trunk directly. Uh huh. She's, she's not doing so good. I think she's kind of crowded from my neighbor's banana plants and her roots. Yeah, there's they not. Keep, they keep popping up all around it. But all the females, the, the fruit goes yeah, directly on. Yeah, because those are the, mostly the pictures I saw. That's yeah. why I was like, well, that looks more like an avocado dangling. Yeah, the, the shape of the females are very round versus the Hermes have a longer shape. Okay. But the, apparently they taste just the same, just as sweet. Okay. And yeah, she died off in the, died in the freeze, the main chunk, so she grew two new ones. But she's really struggling, so I chopped this one back. I'm hoping she'll kind of take a break and sprout out again. So when they sprout, do they sprout uh, from the um, this section here? Yep, yep, just randomly from the chunk. I've okay. noticed that they'll usually sprout kind of low, like this one you can see here. Uh, it's that cherry growing. So I just cut one and put it in a pot and from the one where I cut, you can see there was one right there and mm -hmm. now it's growing three individuals. So I'll leave those and in a few months time, they'll get really thick and big and I'll cut and there'll be three, okay. three brand new ones to give wow. away. And then anywhere you see a branch, like it's trying to grow little branches here. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Anything that grows a branch, you can yeah, cut that off. So those are the little new shoots that can become a plant all together. So that's why I always have so many to give away. It's constantly growing, growing little branches and shoots all off of it. Yeah. This is 